Hey guys, I'm Tefel from Archeo Project and this time we will generate more complicated uh, geometric figure. It will be just pyramid and we read all necessary coordinates, uh, textures, UVs and uh, vertices and triangles just from 3D Studio Max. I hope you uh, like this part. So let's create our uh, procedural mesh and component procedural mesh and this time I will uh, add section but it will be more uh, complicated shape we will generate so create section okay so we need to uh, set vertices triangles uh, UVs and other things but this time we will use uh, 3d studio max just to create more complicated shape and uh, generate it inside unreal engine so we can select box but this time it will be py uh, pyramid so let's move this to the middle and to get uh, all vertices and coordinates and uh, faces i just export this as uh, opg file and it will be pyramid on my desktop and I don't want to uh, coordinate for now and export so I get uh, eight triangles and six vertices which is correct we have uh, five vertices and one on the top so it's six and uh, eight triangles four on the bottom and four on the top okay so we can just uh, get pyramid and we have these vertices right here and all coordinates and faces right here so we can just uh, make a rise from this uh, values uh, inside our uh, Unreal Engine so I need to copy this to my Excel and import so I have these values right here because this is an uh, array of 3D vectors, I need to set uh, X. Second one will be uh, Y and Z. And then close and and should be fine. Let's. okay and we have first array which I can just import okay so let's go back and I have my procedural mesh I can just promote to variable and it will be vertices second one will be triangles and third one UVs okay so right now when i uh, get my vertices i can just paste uh, straight from here and i have my six vertices okay uh, but i need my triangles also and unreal engine 4 uh, starts index says from zero so i need to decrement by one yeah so it's this minus one Okay, but maybe just make. Okay, so right here will be minus one. Okay, and I can just move this. And pasting this and closing because it's array of uh, integers. I can do this like that here. Yeah? So when I copy, I should get 24 values yeah 24 elements and UVs mm, because uh, we need uh, simple movies for this uh, I just need to uh, create uh, UVs so I go to my uh, UV map and use planner so when I uh, export right now uh, pyramid UVs texture coordinates it should be uh, exactly the same UVs like my uh, coordinates 
uh, like my vertices so I have six of them so I can just copy this like before once again and this time it's just a uh, two dimensional array here okay so I just take my X and Y and close this and I can just paste this inside my procedural mesh UVs yeah and paste we have six of them so we have everything what we need so right now when I go to viewport it's like pyramid but uh, we can uh, notice uh, that uh, UV or that normal maps are inverted yeah that's why I need to fix this just ch changing position of my uh, triangles yeah so instead of uh, X uh, first one second one and third one I will just uh, shift this so it will be three to one yeah so I just copy this right here copy this right here and back yeah and I have my values right here so once again when I copy this triangles and paste it's like that yeah so we have everything and this is like pyramid yeah so compile and I can expose this outside so when I put uh, my procedural mesh it should be more like uh, pyramid I can make this bigger okay and uh, yeah when I change this vertices it's just moving up and down let's make this bigger okay and I can uh, move any <laughs> any vertices I want to yeah and modify yeah okay so maybe just apply material uh, so set material for this it will be uh, maybe this brown uh, yeah and compile and we have this like that and once again let's check this out okay so this is everything from this tutorial and right now you should know how to uh, generate more complicated shapes and modify them in real time in Unreal Engine 4 Okay, so see you next time.